Now what I like about the T14 is the Russians took a very um, sober view of the failings of Russian armor in the past. And they said, how are we going to fix the, the problems of this tank, of these tanks? And what you've then got in T14 is an addressing of the gun elevation and depression mm. in, the, in the Soviet era tanks. You've got um, the, the, the ammunition carousel weakness. You've got uh, all the major drawbacks they have addressed. Now, the question mm. is whether they've introduced a whole bunch of new drawbacks in the process. They, they have. I mean, it's like, like the S tank and like um, uh, uh, really is a going outside the, the traditional concept of, okay, these are the vulnerabilities of a tank um, and or what do we want to try and achieve for crew survival is crew survivability going to become our main thing is the tank survivability is the number of tanks we're going to burn uh, like they're going quality quantity over quality no this time they're going for a highly experimental uh, quality tank uh, with a lot of new technologies thrown in there and to see what they can do with it and look is it a uh, demonstrator for overseas sales, yeah, quite probably, um, because they can't afford it themselves. It's not doing very well as a demonstrator. Not for yet, sales, not though. yet. Yeah. <laughs> but it's it's uh, takes 